Hello, English 201 students. Uh, this is Dr. Stevens, and I'd like to read a couple of poems to you. Um, one of your classmates pointed out on the discussion board that reading out loud is a good idea. Uh, it helps you understand a poem better to read it out loud. I quite agree with her. And besides, I like to read poems anyway. So here goes a couple of poems from uh, our Unit 2 readings, one by Shakespeare and one by George Herbert. So we'll begin with uh, the Herbert poem. Uh, it's called Love 3. Love bade me welcome, yet my soul drew back, guilty of dust and sin. But quick-eyed love, observing me grow slack from my first entrance in, drew nearer, sweetly questioning if I lacked anything. A guest, I answered, worthy to be here. Love said, you shall be he. I, the unkind, ungrateful, ah, oh, my dear, I cannot look on thee. Love took my hand and, smiling, did reply, who made the eye? But I, truth, Lord, but I have marred them. Let my shame go where it doth deserve. And know you not, says love, who bore the blame? My dear, then I will serve. You must sit down, says love, and taste my meat. So I did sit and eat. Love three by George Herbert. And here is a sonnet by Shakespeare that you've read for this unit, Sonnet 73, That Time of Year Thou Mayest in Me Behold. That time of year thou mayest in me behold when yellow leaves or none or few do hang upon those boughs that shake against the cold. Bare ruined choirs, where late the sweet birds sang. In me thou seest the twilight of such day as after sunset fadeth in the west, which by and by black night doth take away, death's second self, which seals up all in rest. In me thou seest the dying of such fire as and the ashes of his youth doth lie, as the deathbed on which it must expire, consumed with that which it was nourished by. This thou perceivest, which makes thy love more strong, to love that well which thou must leave ere long. A sonnet by William Shakespeare. Thanks for listening. No commentary on this. We'll talk about these in discussion. So thanks for listening again, and I'll see you online.